Hi, this is Rob Reed with Recreation by Design, and I have the opportunity to bring to you today the Bay Point 243 IKKB. This floor plan has opposing slides in the front, an island kitchen, a huge bathroom, and then a slide out king bed in the rear. Let's get started on the outside of the Bay Point 243 IKKB. Our roof is a superior roof. We have a 16 inch on center. We have 3 8 inch decking up there, and then it's capped with a rubber roof. Uh, so that way you can walk anywhere you want to up there. It's a fully decked roof. It also has two 15,000 BTU roof air conditioners with heat strips on them. On the side wall here, we have 030 metal on the exterior, which is bigger than most industry standard. We also have 16 inch on center, two by two uh, wood studded side walls with R7 fiberglass insulation hand packed in between each of the studs. The front here, you can see that we're a wide body destination trailer. So we're 102 inches wide outside edge to outside edge. Up here, we also have our tinted, we're 80% tint windows. They're 8800 series max airflow windows. So you get 50% airflow through all of your windows. Notice how our front end is a nice rounded uh, bay window area. So that gives you a lot of natural light coming in. Also, we have our LED lights on the outside. You have two porch lights here, and then you also have a light here if you had to hook up or unhook at night. Our floor is a two by four tongue and groove plywood floor. So it's a nice thick floor, R7 fiberglass insulation in there. Uh, we also put R38 radiant heat blanket on the top and the bottom also. Our frame is a 12 inch I-beam frame. Then you have outriggers every uh, 16 inches uh, going across the bottom side of the floor. And that's what your floor is actually carriage bolted to. So it's a nice tight fit. Nice sturdy floor with the tongue and groove plywood flooring up there. This is a detachable hitch, so if you got to your destination and you didn't want to have the hitch on there, you can unbolt your hitch from the front of this camper and then you just have a 39 foot box length destination trailer. On the front here we also feature a battery box. You have your battery disconnect switch here, 30 pound LP bottles with an automatic switch over and regulator. Moving around to the other side here, you're going to see our slide out room. We have opposing slides in the front of this 243 IKKB. Notice how the sides here we have metal and it's a tight fit. Some of our competitors will have a, a little flex in theirs where they don't put back or back here in your side. We build this like a little house. So this is very well built uh, with, with materials that will last a lifetime. On the bottom side here, we put this angle iron, which covers your floor line. Our slide out floor is a one inch thick laminated floor uh, that we also have undercoating on the bottom of it. So it's completely sealed. On the back side here, you're going to see that we have two 7,000 pound axles. Those are 16 inch G rated tires, radial tires. Here is our 40,000 BTU furnace. It is a floor ducted heat furnace, so all the uh, flooring is heated with the, with the air from the furnace there. Here we have an outside shower. It's a hot and cold uh, spigot with a six foot uh, shower head on it. This is your king bed slide in the back. We'll show you more about that in the, uh, on the interior shots here. Moving around to the back side of the unit here, we have all your cable hookups. So your satellite and cable prepped here. This is your potable water. We have a 49 gallon fresh, we have 96 gallon gray, and we have 49 uh, gallons of black on your tanks here. But that's your, your fresh potable water if you wanted to have a potable water. Uh, otherwise, you just have your city water connection here. All of our Bay Point products come with standard with 50 amp service. So that's gonna give you a plenty of service to run both air conditioners, the microwave, washers and dryers if you had that option in there. Rolling along the back side here, you can see the height of our unit. We're 13 foot 4 inches tall from the floor line or the ground to the top of the roof air conditioner. Notice how on our roof it is a cambered roof, so you're going to also have uh, your, your gutter railings along the side and you have a 2 inch drip tube. What that does is from that drip, if you got a good rain, that's going to push the water out here so you don't get black streaks going down your side of your camper. 
Coming around to the camping side here, we feature standard a 20 gallon water heater. This is a regular residential water heater. We use all PEX pipe here, and we're one of the few that still use brass fittings in between rather than plastic. So it's a nice residential style water heater system here, but we give you access to it outside here. Moving down the back side here, you're gonna see our, our rear entry door. Uh, we got your pull-out steps. We put our pull-out steps on these because these are destination campers and a lot of people will build a deck off the back of it. So this step will just fold right in flush with the floor line so that you won't be impeded on if you wanted to build a deck off the back. Uh, featured up here is we got our power awning. It's an electric awning, so you just push a button and it comes out. It also features your LED light strips here as well. Uh, here we have our uh, stereo outside speakers inside we have a residential sound bar DVD sound bar where you can actually play the music outside here from your DVD inside so we also give you a, a 110 outlet here so if you wanted to set up a picnic table here you could still put a, a radio or a George Foreman grill or something like that out here here we have a thermal paned uh, patio door it's a six foot patio door that you can get in and out of easily. Also, we have your large grab handle here uh, on the front to help you get in and out of the camper. Up in the front here, you're gonna have your last slide out room. This is an opposing slide, living room slide. Again, one inch laminated floor, nice tight side walls that are backed, uh, and your 8800 series Max Airflow windows. Now we're in the inside living room of the Bay Point 243 IKKB. What I want to point out to you right away is how tall our interior slide heights are. We're 96 inch interior slide heights. Since we're up here, I also want to show you what we put as deluxe crown molding all the way across the top there to finish off the, the roof to the sidewall look. Another thing that you're going to notice right out of the box is our slide out boxes. Our slide outs are, are uh, seven foot tall slide out boxes. Because we give you such a high interior height, we can put the bigger slide boxes in and it's seven foot from the top of the floor to here. We also put in a deluxe cabinet package. So you're going to notice that on the outside here we have all raised real wood door fronts and you'll see that there's no hinges on here. We use the hidden hinges on all of our, which is an upgrade on all of our Bay Point product lines here. Moving down our window treatments, you have a hardwood window treatment as well, rather than a, a frilly curtain or anything like that. We use the pleated shade, it's a night shade, so you don't see any silhouette or anything on the inside. One of the neat things is our furniture upgrade. We have all American made furniture here and it's a theater seat so it'll recline out. You also have storage on the inside here for your remotes and you also have uh, places to put your drinks. All of our uh, units are all toggle switches for your lights to turn on and off. And you'll notice back here that uh, every seating area in the living room area, we give you a double USB port. So if you were watching your iPad or doing anything like that with a phone, you can plug right in and charge your phone or your iPad as you're playing it. Up here at the front, this is our huge bay window area. Notice how we give you a lot more cabinet storage up here. Up here, you can put a 65 inch TV on the shelf here. You still have opening windows all the way around. This is your residential sound bar. This sound bar uh, is connected to our speakers in the ceiling as well as the front channel speakers here. So you can play your DVDs, you can run your, your music through there with your iPhone because it does have a USB port there. And it's got three different settings, an ABC setting, so that way you can play everything in the A. B is gonna be your bedroom area, and C is gonna be your outside speakers that we saw a little bit earlier in the video. Moving over here to the door side, you're gonna see that this is gonna be the same seven foot tall slide box. Uh, notice at each end of the sofa, since it's a three person sofa, we put dual USB ports at both sides of it. And again, up here you have lots of cabinet storage all the way through uh, the, across this slide out room. Over here, we're using uh, a table and four chairs as standard. Each chair also uh, features a uh, storage area underneath the chair. Uh, and again, we give you big windows around your dining room area so you can see what's going on out in the campsite. And again, I want to stress this a little bit more is every window we have here in the Bay Point series is an opening window. We don't have just light windows only, so you can get a nice cross ventilation if you're not uh, running your air conditioner. Up here is kind of a command center for all your interior lights here. This is your patio door. What we wanted to feature here in this video is that we give you a pleat or a shade, a vertical blind that runs all the way down. So you can pull it away. Uh, 
and have your patio door there, okay? Back over here is our uh, command center. So you can turn on your porch lights, open up your slides, see where your tank levels are at, uh, extend your awning, and this is your thermostat for uh, the air conditioner. Moving more through the, the kitchen galley area, again, you have more storage, uh, lots of overhead storage here. This is kind of a buffet, so you can set your coffee pot here, uh, crock pots and that sort of thing, prep station, and again, you have more storage underneath there uh, for that as well. In this unit, we're featuring our uh, stainless steel appliance upgrade, but all of our appliances are residential appliances in the Bay Point product line. This one just happens to be showing our stainless steel upgrade, so you get a four-door uh, refrigerator with a crisper and a freezer drawer. This is our standard 30-inch five-burner range uh, stove and oven. Uh, this is the same type of range that you put in your house. It's you know five burners with a digital backboard. This is our 30 inch convection microwave of an option. Standard is a regular 30 inch, but this one happens to have the optional uh, convection in it. And again, it's stainless steel, part of the stainless steel package, but you can see it's a residential uh, convection microwave oven, but it's a 30 inch. If you didn't get the convection option, you'd have a regular 30 inch microwave in here. Notice how we have decorative blacks backsplash behind our stove. That keeps your, your wall from getting wet or anything that you might be doing as far as prepping here. Uh, again, you have more outlets here. Notice how we have lots of drawers. There's three drawers here. You got a big pantry here that's got a bunch of shelves on it. So there's five drawers there, three more over here. So there's eight drawers in this kitchen area. So you have a lot of drawer space. And then on this side, we have a pull-out trash can. You always got to have a place to put your trash can at. So we give you a pull-out trash can standard in every one of our units. If you notice, this island kitchen is huge. This island kitchen gives you a lot of prep space. You got your pull-out faucet. You also have stainless steel sinks. They're double bowl sinks, so they're full size, so you can get full size plates in here. We also feature our uh, roll-up uh, sink covers. They just roll right up and they can be put away in a drawer or a cabinet somewhere out of the way. And we give you two of them so you could actually have it as additional counter space. But what I want to point out is our, our feature doors here. These are interior doors and they're four panel doors. So these are upgraded entry doors. The huge bathroom in the Bay Point is right here. You have a lot of storage space here up and down for your linen closet area. You have storage behind your toilet for extra toilet paper and stuff. You have a huge porcelain toilet. Back over here to my left is another linen closet, but this is your washer and dryer prep. So you have adjustable shelves on the top, a, a hard shelf in the middle, and then an adjustable shelf on the bottom. Moving over here, to, I want to show you our huge bathroom area. So you have three mirrored medicine cabinet, all huge residential style. What we do that a lot of our competitors don't is we give you a residential style sink. So it's a porcelain sink, residential faucet, and then we give you lots of storage drawers. So you got three drawers down here on the side of your uh, sink base, and then you also have another storage drawer over here. So it's a huge bathroom area. This is our garden tub. We give you a huge glass area with a, with a shower door enclosure here. We feature a one-piece fiberglass garden tub. A lot of our competitors will give you a two-piece plastic tub, where ours is a one-piece fiberglass. Here, you also have a built-in seat. You have a washcloth bar. We also give you the upgraded shower head and hose. Moving back through, we're gonna go into the master bedroom. This door will come back through the master bedroom. So here, it's a huge bedroom area. So you're going to have an entry door directly into the bedroom if you want. All your light switches and your slide out mechanism is here so you can switch them. You have again lots of overhead storage, a place for a 32 inch TV, all of your outlets are down here that you can hook up your cable or satellite, whatever you have. You have four drawers here that you can store all your clothes in. Back here we have a huge closet with three panel mirrored doors so it gives the appearance of making your room a lot bigger. Um, you also have hanging closet all the way across the back here. We have shelves on either side that you can put your folded clothes on. And then down here we have another four drawers that's underneath your closet area here. What's really cool is we have a king bed. This is a 70 by 80 king sized bed that slides out. You'll notice it's got a nice decorative headboard back there. We put USB ports at either side of the bed. 
light switches on either side of the bed, so that way you can turn on and have one person reading and one person not. You have a uh, inner spring mattress here, and then you also have a lot of storage underneath your bed. It's got strutted storage. Your bed's all finished off on the inside. Again, it's finished off with all plywood, and then you have struts to hold it up. So you have lots of storage underneath the bed area as well. Back here, you also have another digital thermostat so you can control the air conditioner that's in your bedroom. That concludes our tour of the Baypoint 243 IKKB. If you have any further questions or want to find out where you can buy one, you can call me, Rob Reed, at 574-326-3307, or you can email me at rob at rbdrv.com. Thank you for watching the video.